The first example of dirty macking, and this is the most common, is cheating. I don't mean dealing with other women or having other women, but lying about it, lying to your girl, lying to your side chick. That's dirty macking. You're damaging people. You're fucking people over. You're manipulating people. You're being conniving. You're hurting people by doing that. And let me tell you, motherfucker, something. Listen, when you cheating, and again, I'm not saying, hey, listen, this is what I want to do. This is what I'm going to do. But when you sneaking and geeking and lying and cheating, you're going to get caught because the girl who you're cheating with wants your spot. It's not that she not that she wants your spot. She wants your woman's spot. I hope you silly, dumb motherfuckers understand this. And I was a silly, dumb motherfucker before. But that woman wants your woman's spot. It's not necessarily that she wants you. She wants to be treated like her. She wants to be told, I love you every day. She wants a man to come home to her. So it ain't about you. I know you think it's about you and you just fly and your ego just telling you you just a man and you got this chick. It ain't about that. She wants her spot. And so guess what's going to happen? She's going to do things so you can get caught up. I don't care who you are. If you don't have a situation to that woman is like, hey, listen, we just hitting it and quitting it and you treating her like that, it's going to blow up. And if you keep doing that, eventually that woman is going to catch feelings. I don't care if she a whore. I don't care if she a bop or a thought. Women have emotions, all of them. And when you laying up with a woman, you fucking a woman, especially if you fucking a raw, especially if you laying up and kicking it and all this old shit, eventually she's going to start liking you. Eventually she's going to want what your woman has. You understand what I'm saying? And she's going to sabotage your shit. This is why the guys get caught cheating. It's not because guys are dumber and men are smarter. I mean, and women are smarter. It's just that men we know how hard it is to get pussy. So if we got a chick who cheating on her man, which you shouldn't be fucking no dude who especially married, you shouldn't be fucking no, no woman, especially if she married, you know, but you shouldn't be fucking with no woman in a relationship like that anyway. But if men have a, a, a chick who we getting consistent sex from, we're not going to fuck that up. We're not going to sabotage. We're not going to call at 1130 and, and act like, you know, whatever, or send a little text at 2 o'clock in the morning when she know your girl up and she know you sleep. We're not going to fucking uh, leave a little hair strand on your shirt that you don't see on a woman's shirt that she don't see. Women do you like that. They'll leave a hair, one little hair follicle strand, and women know their hair. She not going to fucking... Uh, uh, you know, call you at 9 p.m. when she know you at home with your girl and then you got to go sit outside in the car and all that old shit. Men don't do that, but a woman will do that. This is why y'all get caught up. This is why men get caught up every time. It's it's the seeds that the side chick is planting. It's not that you dumb when you cheating because you, you think you covering your tracks, but you just got somebody working against you. And sometimes women will ruin it all if they can't have it. If they can't have what that woman got shit, right, ain't nobody going to get no love. Then I'm finna ruin your shit, I'm finna ruin her shit, and I'm finna burn the whole house to the ground. That's how women think. But a man, on the other hand, he's not going to do that because he got him some consistent coochie, and he don't want to fuck it up. So he's going to stay silent. He, you know, he not going to do bullshit and put bullshit in the game because he ain't getting his way. So, but... Yeah, cheating is dirty macking for sure. That's just the most common form of dirty macking. When you lying to people, when you you cheating on your woman, when you got a string along a side chick, that's dirty macking. You don't have to do that to have two different women. You don't got to do that. You can be honest with both of them women. And if, like I said, you that dude, you valuable enough, you can get both of them. You know, and and, and I don't mean just money. Or, or tangible shit. Game is valuable. Your leadership is valuable. Who you are on the inside is valuable, and women need that. And so, if you got that, a lot of the times, both of them will fuck with you. I'm not going. I'm not saying that they're not going to hurt or or be damaged by it because more than likely they will be. But you give them the opportunity to choose. That's what a player is, you know. But she ain't, and that ain't P. Having a bunch of holes sneaking and geeking, that ain't pee. So you shouldn't be doing that. That's the most common sign or, or common uh, dirty macking tactic is cheating. 